I'm very fortunate to have found a profession that, that I love doing on a day-to-day -day basis. And every day I wake up and I'm excited to make a difference in the lives of my patients. Maintaining longevity and being able to do medicine at a high pace for 16 to 20 hours a day really requires you to eat right and to work out and to stay healthy. I need something which is going to be intense for about 20 to 40 minutes and be the best workout possible. Boxing is something which is fun, it's effective, it's quick, and, and, it, uh, and it works. The day can get very hectic between surgeries, research meetings, seeing patients in the office. And so those one to two hours in the morning when I get up and there's no one bothering me, that's the time of the day where I can get the most done. It's literally outpatient procedure. Okay. It's an outpatient procedure, uh, so he can give you more details about that, but it's something you should do in the next The best part about months. being a neurosurgeon is the fact that you're able to directly impact the lives of these people and make a significant difference on a day-to-day -day basis. Adios, senora. Okay, que lo pase bien. Nos vemos. So there's the science of medicine and then there's the art of medicine, and I think, especially when it comes to surgery, a lot of physicians leave out the genuine doctor-patient interaction. Uh, one of the best parts of my day, I feel, is rounding on my patients and really, really being able to connect with them uh, and, and let them know that, I, that I'm not only their surgeon, but I also care about them uh, more than just from the operation, but in terms of the overall treatment plan and management, being there for them and really supporting them. I think, I think working hard and playing hard are two things that are, again, very important towards maintaining balance. If you're in medicine and you love it, that's got to be one part of your life. It's a major part of your life, but the time you do get off, you have to enjoy yourself. For me, uh, you know, being outdoors, doing scuba diving, staying athletic, staying active, those, those are absolutely critical. Everybody put a, a hand together for Rick. He is our newly certified open water diver. Yeah. I've always had a passion for neurosurgery, and I think even at a young age, knowing exactly what you want to do makes the work that much easier. You spend such a large portion of your life training and studying to become a neurosurgeon, and then you wonder if it's all worth it, and the answer is yes because you get to really make an impact directly on these people, and it's high risk, high reward, but when you make a difference, there's really no feeling like it. Dr. Ricardo Comotar, renowned neurosurgeon, compassionate caregiver, and one of the brightest minds in healthcare, living life beyond the medicine.